where there is still no new developments on their pursuit of Kyrie Irving. Rumors started to swirl about LA's interest in reuniting LeBron and Kyrie after the aforementioned KD request out of Brooklyn. All right, so with no new point guard in the near future for the Lakers, Dave, what do the Lakers fans hope to see from Russell Westbrook, who they're probably going to run it back with under new coach Darvin Ham? If Russell Westbrook is on this roster and they hope to have better success or any success compared to last season, it's going to come down to the perimeter. Both how he defends the perimeter and how he connects on shots that are created by LeBron James that give him wide open looks beyond the arc on the perimeter. Those were two terrible parts to his game a season ago. And obviously, that should be part of every conversation he's having with Darvin Ham when it comes to finding a way to fit in and help this team next year. If he can defend and be an a, a, a initial point of mm -hmm. uh, thwarting defense when the head of the snake is coming at the Lakers' defense, and then on the other end, if he can make open shots, that'll make his fit exponentially better than it was last year. All right, speaking of open shots that need to be made, who else are they targeting in free agency? The Lakers, that is. I mean, we've heard Darvin Ham say it. We've heard Rob Palinka say it. This team is still lacking shooting to be mm -hmm. a top-tier contender in the Western Conference. The problem is right now they have 13 roster spots filled. There's two spots open. But all the shooters on the market when it comes to free agency, they're not on a team for a reason because more likely than not, they do one thing really well, like spread the floor, but they don't necessarily uh, defend well enough to get minutes. And so they'd have to look to the trade market. And the guys we just saw on video there, Eric Gordon of the Rockets and Buddy Heel of the Pacers, I've reported for weeks now, the Lakers have interest in trying to find a trade package for both of them. I'm of the opinion, though, they will not pull the trigger on a deal like that until they know absolutely for sure that Kyrie Irving cannot happen and will not happen. Uh, really quickly, Dave, any chance that Kyrie moves before KD? I got like 10 seconds. Monica, it's all about KD first. The Brooklyn okay. Nets need to figure out KD before they will be willing to make any sort of move involving Kyrie Irving. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.